Hi, this is John from Final Cut Pro Classes, and this tutorial is about how you can see and separate all your audio tracks in the timeline in Final Cut Pro. Let me show you how to do it. So just to give you an example of what I mean, here I have a timeline that has all of its audio tracks separated into separate tracks. I have dialogue, music, cowboy one, green one, red one, uh, sound effects. So all these are on their separate tracks, and I'm able to work with them separately. Now the way I got this was I went to view and I turned on show audio lanes. I'm going to hide them right now and show you what it looks like. So now it, it puts the audio back into the video clips and collapses all the, the other audio tracks. Now, now the way to properly do this to get the right audio tracks for the right clips, you have to do some extra work. Let me show you what I mean. So the way it works is that it does the tracks by roles okay so if you don't if you're just importing clips in it's given it a default role and it's probably not the right role that you want it so that when i look at this timeline that has the audio tracks turned off and i say show, show audio lanes it's not really what i want because i have a bunch of stuff that's on the same track basically so i'm going to turn that off for a second and hide audio lanes so to do it properly you have to make the roles that coincide with the clips that you have. So let me show what I mean. So I am going to go to modify, edit roles, and I'm going to start making roles that correspond to the event names that I have because I separated all my clips. So I'm going to make a video role called green screen and another one called interview. And I'm going to make all the roles the same names as my events. So now that I've made my corresponding video event roles, I'm going to start making my audio event roles. The first one I'm going to call green screen. Okay, now I have all my audio roles and my video roles sorted out for what I need for this project. So I'm going to apply those. Now all I have to do is go through my clips and apply those roles to my clips in my events. So I'm going to take these clips, highlight them, go to assign video roles, and I'm going to say green screen, go to assign audio roles, and I'm going to go green screen also. And then I'm going to go to my next bin, and I'm going to assign this, audio roles, interview, video roles, interview. And I'll go through all my clips and make sure they have the, the right roles. Okay, so I've assigned all the correct roles to all my footage. So now I can start cutting. So here I am now going to take a short in and out and I'm going to put this clip in and I'm going to go to another clip. And, I'm... and you can see already that it's separating the tracks on these clips because I have the show audio lanes on. So if I go to the effects clip and I take a in and out of this and I would do that and it goes on its own track. So everything goes on its own track, which is pretty cool. So I hope this helps you understand a little bit about how to organize your tracks. And here I put the green screen as the last one and I'll put this at the end or on top. And again, it makes its own green track right here. So that is how you can actually separate your audio tracks, just like the old days in Final Cut X. I hope that helps you a little bit. Thank you for watching. Subscribe or like. See you next time.